uh, workshop was done in collaboration with um, the Queensland um, Academy of Creative Industries. So the students were told about our idea and since they are creative practitioners themselves, we went to them and we asked them how do we motivate and inspire people from this sector to be more creative. The problem statement um, for, for this project was how do we introduce creativity in the not-for-profit sector? Um, how do we um, get the not-for-profit sector practitioners to get out of their comfort zones and introduce creative practice um, on everyday level and also um, a long-term, more strategic levels of their practice as well? We go to a school here that's very much involved in organisational issues. We do creativity all the time. So we thought, why not base it off ourselves? Um, and I think that worked really well because we have a lot of restrictions. It's really hard to be creative within those limitations. And that was something that we wanted to get across, that there's still a way to be creative, even if you, you know, don't have enough money to produce something like really, really beautifully amazing, you can still manage to do that without, um, with the limitations. I think today really gave me some good ideas about how, um, no, how we could just incorporate it into uh, the way we work every day, like having these kind of exercises, you know, where you brainstorm ideas or you think outside the box inside meetings to really like inspire people and engage them and make them realise that, oh, like we're trying to create a different future for ourselves, but and like, to do that we need to think in different ways. In our organisation, like it's a very traditional sort of bush care organisation, and come, you know, it has a long history, but um, we haven't really looked at ways of being creative inside our organisation, and that means that we don't really appeal to a whole broad range of volunteers who are more interested in like you know, doing online technology, using online technology, and really like being able to use their minds in different ways. We were painting how to to work together with each other and um, by being able to only use one colour um, in mixing the colours on the paper um, we learned that um, we cannot work without each other and how every, everyone has and should have um, an input, uh, particularly a creative input in um, putting projects together. I think today it went really well because um, we, I think the interaction with the people at the workshop was really good, like everyone got along really well and the activities we did worked really well as well. So I think everybody had a really good time and it was really interesting to actually work with people who were in the industry or like in non-for-profit organisations and it's actually something that I'm very interested in so it's something that I've really benefited from.